A dolphin swam up to a diver and literally asked the man for help. A pack of about 30 dolphins washed ashore by the tide, but lucky for them, there were people on shore who helped them. The dolphin's mother, who was calling for her cub while kind people on the shore were removing hooks and fishing line from its body. Now I'll tell you six amazing stories about dolphins that would not have survived without human help. Number 6 The hero of this video was swimming with stingrays in Hawaii when a dolphin suddenly swam up to him. At first, the man, named Keller, did not understand what was going on. But then he noticed the hook and line that was wrapped around the dolphin. The man realized that the dolphin was asking for help. The dolphin swam closer and the man had an opportunity to remove the hook. The hook was near the dolphin's fin, so he had to be very careful not to hurt the animal. Soon, the hook was successfully removed. The clever dolphin was in no hurry to swim away because the rescue operation was not complete. The fishing line was still wrapped around the dolphin's body. To get rid of it, Keller decided to use scissors. I don't know if all divers take scissors with them, but this dolphin was definitely lucky that day. It's unbelievable how patient this dolphin is. The whole time the man was trying to remove the line, the dolphin didn't swim even a meter away. One part of the line was right at the dolphin's mouth, and Keller soon removed it. The other part of the line was near the fin, and it took Keller some time, but after a while, he also cut it off. Soon, all the fishing line was removed, and the dolphin simply swam away, waving its tail in farewell. I don't think people realize just how smart dolphins actually are. What an amazing story! Number 5 This poor baby dolphin was entangled in fishing line, hooks, and ropes. A group of tourists was diving nearby and they managed to remove most of the marine waste from the cub. But meters of fishing line were still entangled around both fins all the way to the tail and also dragging about two meters behind. The rescuers beckoned the cub to themselves and then pulled it to the shore where the rescue operation began. They covered the dolphin with a towel and the volunteers began to remove the fishing line wrapped around the dolphin's body. At that time, a mother dolphin swam up to the shore and started calling for her cub. Other dolphins heard her call and also came to see what happened. After a while, the volunteers managed to completely remove the fishing line and hooks. They also treated the cub's wounds and injected some antibiotics to avoid infection. The last step was to return the baby dolphin to its mother and soon they reunited. You can see how much the mother is worried. She swims from side to side when people let her baby go. All moms on our planet are the same. Number 4 In this video, a flock of about 30 dolphins was washed ashore by the tide. Fortunately, there were many people on the beach who rushed to help the dolphins in trouble. People quickly sorted it out and began to send the dolphins back into the water one by one. Some dolphins were small, so only one person could pull the tail and return the dolphin to the water. But some were large, then people together sent the animals back into the water. In a couple of minutes, there were no dolphins left on the shore and the rescuers, obviously pleased with themselves, wandered back to their business. Good job, amazing people! Number 3 A guy named Nicholas was riding a jet ski near the coast when he noticed two dolphins. Riding with dolphins is a dream for many people who participate in water sports. One dolphin was swimming normally, but the other was moving a little strangely, which drew Nicholas's attention. The boy decided to check what was the problem. When he swam closer, 
He saw that there was a rope on the dolphin's body, and that was the reason why the dolphin moved so strangely. Nicholas decided to call his friends, who were also swimming nearby, and help the animal. Together, they pulled the dolphin closer. The boy jumped into the water, where he managed to cut one piece of rope with a knife. Nicholas said later that one thing that surprised him was the dolphin's reaction after he had cut part of the rope. The dolphin started snatching and looked at him with eyes full of trust. The rescue operation was not easy because the rope was very tight. But after five minutes, the rope was completely removed and the dolphin could swim without problems. Hold on, baby. Hold on, baby. Hold on. After releasing the animal, Nicholas continued riding. Later, he said, he was joined by a pack of seven or eight dolphins. Probably they were expressing their gratitude for saving their friend. Great job, Nicholas. They're in the water right there. They're all swimming with me. I think they were thanking me. Number 2 When doing paddleboarding in the sea, many people dream of dolphins swimming nearby because it's a pleasure to watch them. The hero of this video decided to make a video with dolphins jumping out of the water and hunting for small fish. Suddenly, the man heard heavy breathing behind him. He turned around and saw a very exhausted and tired dolphin. The guy quickly realized what the problem was. There was a fishing line wrapped around the dolphin, which obviously prevented it from swimming and could cause the dolphin's death. The animal seemed to ask for help, and of course the man could not refuse. The man caught the fishing line and pulled the dolphin closer. The dolphin didn't resist at all. The animal seemed to decide to trust the man completely. The fishing line was very tangled and there was no promise of a quick rescue. But the dolphin was very patient. First, the rescuer managed to free the tail, then the most difficult thing was to free the dolphin's mouth. The fishing line was wrapped around its mouth in such a way that most probably the animal could no longer feed. The dolphin's breathing was also heavy. It was very tired. Although the video is quite short, I found out that the rescue operation took about 10 minutes. And all this time, the dolphin patiently stayed nearby and didn't think to swim away. Fortunately, all ended well and the dolphin was rescued. Number 1 People were spending time on a yacht when they noticed a dolphin entangled in a fishing net. They did not dare to rescue the dolphin themselves, but called the police. An officer named Nelson arrived on the scene. Little baby dolphin. The dolphin was clearly panicking as it was unable to get out of the net. The video you now see was taken from the officer's body camera. Using a long pole, the man hooked the net and pulled the dolphin to his boat. Come on, little guy. Come here. Okay. The first attempt was unsuccessful. The dolphin panicked and swam away from the boat, but was still in the vicinity. Nelson repeated the same actions and pulled the dolphin up and began to cut the net. It's okay. It's okay. Although the dolphin clearly disliked these events, it did not swim away again. After a few minutes, the man's persistence was rewarded. The net was cut. Gotcha. Woo! Yeah! It is sad to see how many beautiful dolphins get caught in fishing nets. I hope if you watch this video and you are a fisherman, you will be more responsible about your hobby. It's okay, little guy. Relax. Also, I have five wolf rescue stories, like the one about the wolf that got caught in the wire fence and its rescue operation didn't go according to plan. Click on the video to see stories about wolves who needed human help. See you there!